I can say that in general, queerness is kind of like a celebration and that's what always drew me to it is that you take ownership of who you are and your what you'd like and that's hard in a world that tells you that it's not okay. I'm an underground artist and musician and a lot of the circles that I travel in are in queer circles. So I feel like a queer celebration happens almost every night for me. <laughs> I think labels are just important for identifying a feeling initially, but I don't think they're everything. When I first discovered that I even was queer, I kind of, I came out as bisexual, but it's not necessarily something I would identify with now. Queer, mainly known for its dictionary definition of you know, weird, not normal. And I think what the community has done is reclaim that word to be positive. When I embraced my queerness, it became a lot easier because I think just being female in this society, you're kind of pressured into like having your whole existence revolve around a man and your whole importance revolving around a man. And I was very pressured into that. It was confusing because I like, I loved being female, but I didn't love the attachment to male satisfaction. So just do you. And I think that's what gender expression should be about. I think people are so cute when they do themselves. Like, like I think people are a lot hotter when they're just like expressing <laughs> what they want to, you know?